back. My name is Tamika. We're gonna go ahead and just hop right into it. I've already done my brows and I've based my eyelids already for um, eyeshadow. This month is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, so I just wanted to do a quick look. Um, my gr grandmother passed away from breast cancer, so I was like, why not? You, you see me, I'm just going all out. Oh shoot, my shirt even says pink. Going to take a fluffy brush. And I'm going to start, I'll start off with a very soft pink just for the transition first. A very soft pink. You want to tap the excess off. Yeah. And just start to go into the transition area. Okay. Same fluffy brush to build that in next. Ooh, kind of purpley. Just a little bit, that's probably just about it. <clears throat> Blend it out. Still into that transition area. Okay, and we're gonna do the same thing with the other eye. Right up in there, right up in there, right up in there, right up in there. Okay, now I'm going to go in with another pink, this pink here, which is even brighter. Same fluffy brush. Same one. Let's add that one here. And circular motions does a good blending job for me. I'm going to go in with an e.l.f. blending brush. I'm going to go in next with the Urban Decay Electric Palette, and I am going to use the color Savage. It's a very, very bright um, pink. And I'm going to start popping that with a smaller um, blending brush in my crease. And I can definitely tell the difference with this pink. Woo! Woo! Great. So I'm going to blend out the edges of it. Just the edges, because I really want that that pink to pop through. It's really pretty. Sheesh. Yeah. Matter of fact, I'm going to put that in here, too. Not even going to lie. Yeah. You know what? Go ahead and just pop it on my whole eye. Look at it. This look is going to be bright, because I'm just popping that all over. It's a very, very bold look. Yeah. We're gonna do the same thing with the other eye. Pop it all over. And blend out the edges a bit. Just to see where this is going. This is a, this elf brush is a really good blending brush. Oh, and I forgot to show y'all my nails. It's pretty in pink. Yeah. Okay. All right, I like that. It's really bright. Add a little bit more in the inner portion here to get that brightness. NYX Glitter Glue. You thought we were done? No, we're gonna add some pink glitter. I'm gonna take some um, NYX Glitter Glue. I'm just gonna use this um, small flat brush. Guess what color it is? Pink. All right, squeeze, I have, oh! Right here. the in there all right i'm scared of glitter guys because i just feel like it's a lot but at the same time i'm not used to looks that do a lot but we're going to take the nyx professional makeup we're going to use this bottom color these colors are pink <laughs> purple and luna we're going to take pink at the bottom and they're like little twist offs it's cute so it's three colors in one the bottom one is pink, so we are going to take the, I'm actually going to use that same brush that I did the glitter with. Ooh, and oh yeah, this is gonna be pretty guys. Oh my gosh. Just all, yeah, all in that little halo type area, I guess. Oh, this is like my 
second time using glitter in my whole life. Look at that, that's pretty. I feel like I need to add just a tad bit more of the glue. Right. And I'm gonna go back into this savage color just to try to add some more of that. Ooh, 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 yeah, like that. I like it, I like it a lot actually. I'm gonna use the NYX Epic Ink Liner in the color black. And I'm gonna to try to do a wing, uh, uh, a wing line. And it's not gonna be a very, very dramatic wing. Cause I don't, I don't like very, very dramatic wings. Dramatic, you can go up. Kind of attach that there. Yeah. Just like that. And we're gonna stop there because I feel like I'm gonna mess it up. Give me anxiety. Baby wipes. I feel like I have sensitive skin, and I mean, these are baby wipes. They're for babies. They're really gonna help me out with the feeling of my sensitive skin. My dad thinks he's funny. He'll walk up to me and say, hey, y'all. And I just look at him like he's crazy because I know he's talking about me and my bumps. So tell your friend I said, hey, I'm going to a little family gathering, cookout, making crabs and in a pot, hopefully shrimp, corn, all that. Mac Prep and Prime skin base. It's small because I got it out of my Ipsy bag. It's a travel size. It has like little sparkles in it. So it peeks through, I think, once you put on your, your foundation. So I can get these these uh nice photos and i'm gonna post photos on my instagram underscore mika michelle underscore s is how you find me all right so we are primed let me close up my pink glitter before it gets all on me this is too dark for me just a little too dark for me it's the LA Colors Truly Matte Long Wear, um, Long Wearing High Pigment Foundation. And I think this was the darker color that they had. I just want them to come up with a few more colors. And I'm also gonna mix it. We'll see how this goes with my MAC Pro Long Wear Nourishing Waterproof Foundation. I like it because it sets, it's waterproof and I sweat a lot. So I am going to put some drops of, and this one is pretty thick. See how that just didn't fall? I am going to go in with um, a flat brush and just kind of blend that in. Ooh, ooh, don't drop it. All right, I'm going to go in with some concealer. I'm going to use the um, LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Warm Honey. Shouts out to Cardi. Oh, my friends are also going to let me do their makeup today. <laughs> Forehead right above those brows. Gonna go all up on the side of this your nose. Yes. Okay. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but because I brought the highlight, I learned this from Makeup Shayla, but because I brought the highlight um, 
and all the way on the side of my nose. The natural foundation color is peeping through because we did the highlight in the middle and we did the highlight on the side of the nose. So right here, you can kind of see those two strips of the foundation still kind of seeping, peeping through. I'm gonna set all the places where we did the highlight. All of those places where we did the highlight. I am not gonna bake. I don't like baking to me. It, it makes me look cakey. And I feel like it makes a lot of people look cakey. Drag the brush down the center of my nose. And my smile lines here. Okay, and then I'm going to set the rest, the rest of my face with the Black Radiant Soft Focus Finishing Powder in the color Creamy Bronze. So I just swoosh around in there. Kind of brush over where I did the um, setting powder a little bit just to give it a little bit of color. Or my forehead. Brush up under there. Yeah, looking a little on the ashy side, but that's okay, guys. It's it's okay. We're going to go ahead and um, contour it. We're going to use LA Girl Pro Face High Definition Press Powder. Wet and Wild kind of angled brush a little bit. Just dab in there twice. Knock off some little excess powder and start to carve, carve out my contour here. Start by your ear and then drag it down so it just won't look like you started here and just hold it. You won't have this 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 huge um markation. Yeah. And then I kind of brush it up to the temples a little bit. Same thing on the other other side. Start closer to your ear and drag it inwards. So I just won't have like a big brown mark just coming through on the side of my face. I don't do a whole lot of contouring just me that's just me i'm gonna go with my anastasia beverly hill blush trio palette in the color vegas so in this color right here and this is to more so warm up my face so i kind of go in with this one just act crazy just keep blending it and i smile a little bit be cute And this is the same thing. I start more so on this way and kind of just drag it inwards. So when you see me going like this, I'm not really going back and forth. I'm more so doing swipe, swipe. Bring that in like that. And I'm actually going to use that to kind of just, ooh, I saw that already. Ooh, yes. All right. Now we're going to go in with some pink, whoo, some pink um, blush. Oldie, but to me, goodie. It's a BH Cosmetics 10 color professional palette. Just go like that and smile and just pat it. Cause you don't want it to be too, too, too crazy. Just smile, apples of these cheeks. Oh, wait. All right, so next what I want to do I'm telling y'all, the next time y'all see me, I'm gonna be dramatic and have one of them like Frah! fans. You know, the ones that kind of like whew, open. So I would usually put black in here. I wanna do, yeah, honey. Yes, okay, that's, that's what I wanted. I want to smudge a little bit of pink in my waterline. That one right there under where I put the white because I don't want to take my white away. And that's exactly what I want. Bam, 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 bam. And the mascara that I'm going to use is the Maybelline. It's the Big Shot Colossal um, Mascara. And it was a collaboration with uh, Makeup Shayla. Mm -hmm. All right, so 
I'm gonna go in with my lash glue here. Make it tacky, make it tacky. Also, be. Okay, okay. My real lashes are so freaking curly. It's hard to get these things in there, man. All right, just kind of trying to. What kind of lip should I do? Yeah, I don't know if y'all can see. I'm sorry if you can't, but this is hard. Just kind of pressing it together with my real lashes. Okay. All right, I'm going to spritz my face just one more time really quick. So now we're going to highlight and we're going to use this Nomad Cosmetics highlight right here. I mean, it's really pretty. Look at it. Yeah, that's a really pretty highlighting color. And then I just put some here. It's not a highlight that has like glitters in it. It's more like a, a shimmering highlight. And those are the kind of highlights that I like. This is really pretty. It's actually turned out to be one of my favorite ones. And we are going to do Rudolph right up in there. And I'm going to put some in my brow bone. Look at that. Maybe a soft, oh, a soft pink would be pretty. I'm gonna use a NYX lip liner pencil in the color Citrine, I think. In the color Citrine, I think. Revlon lipstick in the color Prime Rose. Ooh. I like it. And it kind of blended into that lip liner like perfectly. Guys, I think we're done. I like it. Shots out for the inspiration for breast cancer awareness. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Because I love it. I'm in love. It's very different for me. I'm in love. It's dramatic. A dramatic pink. I feel like I should go to some breast cancer awareness event. But um, I'm gonna go have fun for the rest of the day, meet up with my friends, do their makeup however I want to, meet up with my family, eat some seafood, see how this lasts. Make sure you check out my Instagram. Um, it's in the description box below. The picture should be on there of that. I'll most likely take some pictures of my friend's makeup as well, and that'll be on my Instagram. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe because I know you're coming back. I know you guys watch the video. I mean, just click it. It's right there. Use your finger right now. Just click it. Click it. All right. Well, until next time, you guys have fun. It's the weekend. Um, this is a Saturday at 12 o'clock. I'm gone. All right. Have fun. Live life. Peace.